मैक्सवेल इक्वेशन फर्स्ट मैक्सवेल इक्वेशन इन अबसेंस ऑफ एनी डायलेक्ट्रिक और मैग्नेटिक मेटीरियल मीन्स वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी मैक्सवेल इक्वेशन इन फ्री स्पेस और वैक्यूम और वी कैन से दैट देर आर नो डायलेक्ट्रिक और मैग्नेटिक मेटीरियल इज प्रेजेंट Now, Maxwell equations are not any new equations. These equations are basic equations of electromagnetism. The first equation is Gauss law of electrostatics. According to which, the integral of the area integral of electric field is equal to 1 upon epsilon naught times the charge enclosed by that surface that is the total and this represents the total electric flux the total electric flux through any closed surface equals the net charge inside the closed surface divided by epsilon naught and this law that is gauss law of electrostatics relates the electric field to the charge distribution due to which the electric field is there or this law relates an electric field to the charge distribution that creates the elect this electric field the second maxwell equation is gauss law for magnetism and according to this the total magnetic flux through any closed surface is always equal to zero or we can say that the number of field lines that enters the closed volume must be equal to the number of field lines leaving that volume or magnetic field lines cannot begin or end at a point it means magnetic monopoles does not exist isolated magnetic monopoles does not exist so magnet is a dipole having two poles north pole and south pole the third maxwell equation is faraday's law of electromagnetic induction and the general form of faraday's law of electromagnetic induction is that line integral of electric field over any closed path is equal to negative of rate of change of magnetic flux with respect to time and this line integral of electric field over any closed path this is also known as emf so the emf induced in a closed path or closed loop or closed circuit is equal to negative of rate of change of magnetic flux with respect to time so the faraday's law of electromagnetic induction this law describes the creation of an electric field by a changing magnetic flux or by a changing magnetic field the fourth maxwell equation is known as ampere's law or general form of ampere's law or ampere's maxwell law with the modification that's why ampere maxwell law because the modification in the ampere's law was provided by maxwell and according to this the closed integral closed line integral of magnetic field along any closed path is mu not times the conduction current plus mu not into epsilon not times the rate of change of electric flux with respect to time through that closed loop now here we are using so this is first maxwell equation second maxwell equation third and fourth maxwell equation in some textbook the order is different that is 
फर्स्ट मैक्सवेल इक्वेशन सेकेंड मैक्सवेल इक्वेशन थर्ड 